Hello everyone, my name is Neil. Welcome to another Acoustic Sessions. Uh, for those of you who know what I do, no surprise, uh, for those of you who don't, uh, welcome. What I try and do is, is give a few tips on getting best, better live acoustic tone, but also song ideas that you might like to play and see how songs like. Songs you might not have thought that would work on acoustic guitar um, in a live situation, but I think probably do. So what I'm doing today is something a bit different. What I've been working on for a little while, trying to get in my head, is a wireless pedal board. And I think I've done it. So I'll, sh I'll run you through it. Let me see what you think. Uh, and then let's see what the tone sounds like. So what I've got is my Taylor GS Mini, which is the one I presume predominantly use for live. Yeah, um, no cable. Out here is the Sennheiser uh, connector, which goes into the its connector here. Which they, this is the um, transmitter, which goes into the receiver here. This is the Sennheiser XSW. It's got a mute function here, so this is the bleed that the will hear through the microphone. Shouldn't be too much. Yeah, and it's got a a nice tuner here, which works really well. So the signal chain passes through the Sennheiser transmitter into the, rec the XSW receiver here, through the voice print, which I've done another session on. Uh, I think it's a, a game changer. Um, listen, if you're a bit quacky in your tone or, or you just want to feel that there's something else missing in your tone, do it. I'm a big believer that sometimes not all tone things need to be for the audience. They need to be for the guitar player so he can relax and he's happy with his sound. I think that's really important psycho psychologically. Um, Excuse me. Then the sound passes through the Eventide H9, which I haven't done one on. I think this is brilliant pedal. It it's, it's, does everything. Uh, check it out if you haven't. Uh, what I've also done is I've also got this linked via MIDI cable here to the Boss RC10 looper. So when I do tap tempo here, it automatically goes through there, which I think works well for delays and uh, if you want um, kind of echoes or tremolos in the same time, that works. And then it all goes out through the the Session DI, good mute button on it if you need to cut the, the sound, but also good t tone shape. And I don't have it too radically set, but it works. So, and then what else? Yes, it goes out through a, another wireless receiver transmitter set I have, the one I mainly use for electric guitar, which is the Line 6 G30. So here is the, uh, the, the, the transmitter, which I would normally have in, into my guitar. Yeah. And the receiver unit's over there, which is the, 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 the transmitter, the, sorry, the receiver unit for the Line 6 G30 here. And it's powered by this pedal train battery. So no cable so far. Now, the uh, my pedal board, I don't know if you can see, is powered by this uh, Chux 4. Yeah, it's kind of falling off, so I won't show it there. Chux 4, that's the uh, the power that I'm using, which works really well. Four units, and it's, it's very high powered. Uh, and there's, it can be powered by 24 volt battery, if you wish, but I've got it powered by this, which is a um, just a kind of uh, iPad, iPhone uh, power chart, power cell. Yeah, so that's done through USB-C into there, attaches underneath. Yeah, so the the, the Line 64 is absolutely tiny and minuscule. I don't know if you can quite see it here, but that's all the size of it is. You know, about three inches, two and a half, three inches by four inches. It's absolutely nothing. So that works well. Yeah, I just need to stick it better under there. So, okay, how does it sound? Well, let's go, let's find out, yeah? So. I think that works. Just a few, a few records. That works well to me. I don't feel latency anywhere, you know? And I don't feel it's losing any tone. Let's try a bit of finger picking. Let's try a little bit of uh, higher up stuff. Very fine.
Anyway, I hope you found that somewhat useful. I think it works well. I'm not hearing any interference. I'm not hearing any noise. I'm not hearing any delay. I think it works well. See you next time.